Hello friends. In this video I will show you inside a simple handy drill machine. So this drill machine is of Yuri brand. I know this is not a famous brand and also not expecting that you people have heard about this brand. But I have worked with this machine and its work output is good. So uh, now I will open it up and show you inside this machine how it works and what are the mechanism inside its body so I'm opening the back cover so here I removed the back cover this is the push switch or you could say it as a pull switch because whenever you will hold this drill machine you need to pull it back using your forefinger and this is the carbon brush which is having a fine contact with commutator connected to the rotor so here you could see the upper carbon brush and the lower carbon brush which is connecting which is having a fine contact with commutator you can see these are the individual contact points and each splits is having individual connection to the coil so whenever we are triggering it up the current is supplied to each coil in every rotation due to which it is creating a magnetic field and due to that magnetic field it is getting rotated so here i am taking out the carbon brush so it is fixed with a spring so that a sufficient pressure could be applied to maintain a fine contact with the commutator so i will fix it again and and show you how it is getting rotated so i will just rotate it manually to show you what happens inside so the carbon brush came out so i need to hold it so as you could see the carbon brush is having continuous contact with the commutator to supply power continuously to each coil connected to that splitted commutator so this is the mechanism happening in the back of drill messing so like this it is working here here you could see this is the stator soft iron core and that's the rotor soft iron core and the coil so so uh, that's it in the back of drill machine and now i will fix it with the screws because this portion is finished and further i will open the front portion and we will check out the geared mechanism inside it so here i'm opening the front part let's do it quickly i'm fast forwarding the video to save the time so this is the front part here i can see there is only one uh, geared wheel uh, so this is the only wheel which is available inside it and it is getting rotated with this spiral soft it is having the spiral grooves on it so let's turn it on and it is too free because there is no load on it i have removed the load so it is rotating very freely which in result increased the rpm at this point of time so once the load is fixed then the rotation the number of rotation is less the rpm will be less but anyway this drill machine is good if you want to drill into a wall or wood or iron 
or concrete etc rest depends on drill bits so here something is getting stuck in the back side so again i need to open up the back portion of the drill machine so as i can see this uh, carbon brass uh, stucking with the bearing ball bearing mechanism so i have removed the carbon brass now a little push is required from the back side of the machine so a little more i will push it that's the bearing so i will push it from a forefinger here the rotor come out this is the bearing and this is the rotor soft iron which is having several turns of coil on it you could see the coil on the rotor so it is having one fan in the front to cool down the rotor and the coil so there is a hollow space and you could see the stator uh, on the inner wall of the machine and this black plastic cover is the protection i think it's the protection to the stator coil you could see the coil from the back and no doubt the stator coil is also winded on soft iron core so that's it that's the mechanism so both the coil is getting magnetized and due to the repulsion the force is generated there are several mechanism behind that that you need to study in in physics in alternators you can get these details what type of force what type of torque and friction is produced inside a rotor in, and stator so this is the basic concept what i am giving to you so due to the repulsion it is generating a opposite force and stator will stay there and rotor will rotate due to the force generated between them i mean the rotor and the stator so uh, it get fixed so uh, just i need to place everything on their position a little more push required okay it's done so now so uh, as you could see here it is rotating freely and now i will fix and now i will fix this carbon brush inside the plastic cover here is the connection and this is the carbon brush so like this i need to fix it need to press the spring with the help of carbon press as you could see it is fixed and now it is having a fine connection with the commutator so again i need to do the same thing with another carbon press so it should fix properly to have a proper contact between the carbon brass and the wire which is providing electricity to the carbon brass so again i need to press the carbon brass actually i am pressing the spring with the help of carbon brass so uh, it is fixed now
so here I can rotate it manually as you could see so the back portion is completed and now I will test it but this is too dangerous as 240 volt is passing from commutator to power the coil so here uh, I'm trying it once again but uh, it is highly recommended not to do this even though you are an experienced person so it's done for the back part of the machine so now I will fix it up so it's done and now time to fix the front part here you need to keep one thing in your mind it should have sufficient greasing between gears but in this case there is sufficient greasing on gears so I need not to worry about it and now I will fix the screws here I will make the video fast forward to save the time and it's done let's switch it on oh forgot to provide the power supply okay it's done so in this way this simple drill machine is working and like this if any problem occurs in your drill machine you could change or replace the mechanical part and that's it for today hope you enjoyed the video so please do like share and subscribe the channel for the upcoming videos and if you are having any query or suggestion please do type it in the comment box below